Whoa. What the fuck is this? What is this place? This is the womb of requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student mm. might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. This I don't plan to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now, this where is, is crazy. Deke? <laughs> Fucking Deke. Deke, Professor. The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This presents the perfect opportunity Ooh, to teach Evanesco. you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. All right, let's go. Too easy. Oh shit. Triangle, X, square, triangle. Triangle. X square triangle. Too easy. Evanesco. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Excellent. Oh, work. shit. You'll note that you are Poof. now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Mm. Let's move on. Oh, I have moonstone. I have a shit ton of moonstone. I've been Where finding so much of that. His name is that elf. All right, this is crazy. This is crazy. What is this? Is that... Goodness, my old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity hmm. to explore on your own until we locate Deke. I don't know what I yes, just professor. found, but that's interesting. Something about her school bag, but I just found a letter. Someone waiting for ages. Interesting. Oh, dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are going to rest. <laughs> what? What are you talking about, lady? You just walk. Oh, it gives you moonstone. Oh. Hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. I'm gonna get lost in here, bro. Stop them. Where? No, not that's not helpful, you well, <laughs> This dude fell apart. <laughs> he folded under pressure. That is unfortunate. Nice try. Respect the effort though. Bit offended the room thought I needed a bath, cheeky thing. What was that? that was the Dalian key? Was that a golden snitch? A golden snitch! Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> Reminds me of Tim Burton's movies, bro. Oh shit, so you could adventure, you could walk around in here for fun. Got the flu flames. The hell is that? That's Deke, bro. Is that Deke? What's Deke doing, bro? Yikes! Careful, huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. <laughs> Let's go, Deke. Uh, 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 hello. Ah, oh, Deke. We've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. I'm Deke honored to meet you, Deke. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. Damn, he's we old. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Mm. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Please. Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. 
deep seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them, mm. you seem to have accessed it in its form as the room of hidden things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. Brilliant. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely Dude, that. Dude, imagine a room that can give you anything and everything now, you want. it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will This is crazy. <laughs> you can't even see my eyes. My eyes are wide open. Eyes wide shut. Everything, bro. Oh, this is crazy, bro. Holy shit. Dude. Whoa. Oh my god. You've given yourself quite a canvas to work with. Oh wait, is this where I can put my furniture? I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. So this is where you put the furniture. Ah, I got you. The room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify uh... unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. Ah, you've unlocked the desk of description. Okay. No unidentified gear. I don't have anything for this at the moment. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. This is interesting. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Hmm. X square triangle X. Easy. Two new spells in a matter of ten seconds. Ten minutes. Very good. So I guess I'll throw it there. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow ah, plants. Okay. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Put that on the wall. Put, that, put a head on the wall. Let me try and brew some stuff. I don't have anything that I want to make. I don't think I've ever made a Maxima Potion. I need those four. Might as well do the side quest. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Might as well. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. I have a bunch of that. You can I have the moonstone yeah, you requested, I had, Professor. I have <laughs> Good. Deke's working in the background. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Okay. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. All right. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? See, I already put one on the wall. Put that there. Put that there. All right, so I have one for the floor. I have to put one on the wall. Put that there. Oh, I have to put five of each. What the hell? All right, let me put. Let me put a couch down. Put a couch down. Good work. 
Shall we move on? Is that everything? Yeah. I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering what is that? spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. You can change the colors, patterns, and mm. styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Mm. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. All right, let me see. It. Oh, this is an actual spell. Okay. Too easy. Too easy. Come on. It's too easy. Nice. Just aim your wand at any conjured item. And... Altering spell to customize it. So let's just say I wanted to customize that. Oh my god. Nicely done. There we go. Now I'm you're done. ready for something a little more advanced. Alright, now what? You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Oh my god. I like the stone. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? Deke, would you mind? What is he of about course, to do? Professor Weasley. Professor yes. Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience. What does that even mean? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Outdoorsy. Yeah. I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy, yeah. as though I'm outdoors. Yes. Oh, sounds perfect. <laughs> Snap the fingers. He's got it. Well, there's a book up there I need to get. There's two of them. Three of them. Hmm. Quite a difference. This is very different. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank nice. you, Professor. Thank the you. room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. What the hell's happening? What the hell is this? What, I got my own library? What the fuck? Dude! Dude! Oh my god! So what's this, my living quarters? An even bigger space. How did that happen? The room equips itself to your needs. It must have I guess I needed more, more space to practice spell casting. I guess. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spell crafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. Right. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. All right. Thanks, Professor Weasley. All right. So that's done. Was that down here? I think it was. Whoa. This is crazy, bro. Holy shit. Phew. Are those all fucking books I need to get? I don't think so, right? I don't think I can get those. This is crazy, though. This is nuts. Map chamber in the room requirement. Helpful puff common room. If I go here, I think I only need four. Should be over here, right? There's nobody awake. There's nobody here. 
This Dedalian Keys challenge is coming along nicely. I think, yeah, I only need four left, I think. Yep, I need four. It's crazy. There's a side quest blowing me as well. We're gonna do this though. Talk to my boy Sebastian Salo. What's up, brother? Over here. <laughs> we sneaking around again? Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention. But I have ways <laughs> this guy out get of out these of things. It. Well, you took the fall for me. And that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did. But something was missing. I'm not sure here Ooh. is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment. In the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. What? Dude, show me this it's place, fine. bro. Yeah, let me see this shit. Hold on, wait. Before we go, I have a feeling I'm gonna need this. There's a secret passage just here. Let me see. It's well disguised. Where? Hmm. Dude. <laughs> Is he gonna come in here with me or what? How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. Oh he my named god. Me we used to play Govstones here all the time. Whoa. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you. I swore to Ominous I would safeguard us. Got you. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. Alright. We used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. Interesting. Alright, so I found a new place. Let's talk. I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. That's Is true. that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. Interesting. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one. I got you. Especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special right. to him. I keep his secret with me. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin. Oh shit. One of the four founders of Hogwarts. Wow. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous cannot abide them. As he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to. Away from prying eyes, hmm. and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the blasting curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. Well, teach me, brother. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. <laughs> A yes. spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. So it's a fire but spell. you should learn it. I can teach it to yes. you safely here. Yes. It's a fire spell. It may take a while to get the feel for it. That's all right. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Confringo. Very well. Let's do this. Triangle XX square. Got him. Needed that. Dude, I've learned three spells already, bro. Let's go. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? Yes. Stick to the target. Best to keep the Undercroft intact. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses, but I think you'll find that a Confringo cast travels. Confringo! Nice work. How does it feel? It feels fucking it's great. It's a tad hot. That's it. I think I've got it. Beautiful. Well 
done. Thank you, Sebastian. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we seized <laughs> our eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. This dude's addicted to the film. I'm ready for more spells this like this. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came from. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, Ooh, you're gonna teach I me another one? Man and ominous about every one. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do, perhaps when I next head to Felcroft, you could come along. Yeah. Any time. She could of use course. some cheering up. Yes. I'd be glad Just to. Just let me know when, and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Sorry. Right. Meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't I'm discuss out him. in the hall earlier? I'm, I'm telling not him. sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me about the port key it and was. Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. You must promise to keep this between yeah, us. Yeah, I'm trusting I him. trusted you with knowledge of the secrets Undercroft. You can Dude, trust, trust me. Imagine my right. boy. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. <laughs> what does that even mean? What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, does it allow you to wield this magic too? I... I, I don't know. Well, when you do know, tell me. I've been studying archaic forms oh my of God. magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting curses in order. Spend yeah. as much time here as you'd like. Thank and you, remember, Sebastian. Keep this place between us. Yes. Of course. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you. Peace out, Sebastian. Peace out, Sebastian. You there? I can hear you. Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone. And not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. Chill. I'm not afraid to exploit that connection Chill, if bro. I need to. Relax. Relax. Trust me, Ominous. I won't say a word. And Relax. Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank Chill, you bro, very you much. Snob. Ominous, I just meant... I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Chill, bro. Fuck this Sebastian's guy, man. Sebastian's going to get an earful about this. You're a little bitch, bro. You're a little fucking bitch. That's what you are. Fucking loser. Fuck away from me. Fucking bitch. God damn it. Piss me the fuck off.